Fire Land. Woo! Damn straight. Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Europa Universalist 3 Divine Wind. We are your host Shenra, currently playing as the Kingdom of Ireland with King Sean the First, McMurrah Kavanaugh. The McMurrah Kavanaughs have been our original kings from uh, the territory of Leinster, and we share the kingdom with the uh, leader of Bavaria, who is King Albrecht the First, McMurrah Kavanaugh, which is fantastic. Anyway. Let's go ahead and jump in game. Looks like we're still at war with Hesse. See if I can get out of that sometime soon. Although I think last time I checked they said they weren't interested. But let's speed up time and zoom out a bit. Oh, looks like some harsh winter over here in Russia. Don't care. Okay, what's up Hesse? Want peace? Oh, we don't have a diplomat. Well, I guess we can't get peace then, can we? How about we send out some colonists? Oh, uh, March. Uh, we'll just wait then. We'll send one to Dakota when the time is right. When the time is right. Alright, we just finished our war with Austria. We made them spit out these territories. That was fantastic. And I s think I said I wanted to go to war with the Wu again sometime soon. Do we have a truce with them? We do not. So we can go to war with them whenever the hell we want. We just need a freaking diplomat. So, we shall speed up time and get some diplomats. Yes, yes, our armies are getting back where they should be. Things are all good. Where the fuck's my navy? There it is. There you go, save my, my army over here. Uh, oh, diplomat, good, good, good. Let's see. Let's get peace with Hesse. They won't accept it. Okay, then. Hansa still likes us, Russia still likes us. Let me go through my list of people who should like me, because sometimes this list gets a little out of order. Like, Nepal, don't care. Toulouse, don't really care. Longzong, don't care. Just looking for vassals, and it looks like all my vassals are still happy with me. So we're okay. Paul, for some reason, is not too thrilled with me. But I'm not sure I should care. We're not allied or anything. How about we send them a warning? Yeah, fuck you, Nepal. Oh, Dakota, yes, yes, yes. Malwa, oh no. Oh no. Oh, come on, you can walk faster than that. Arkansas is core. Oh, oh, they want peace. Shit, we missed it. I wasn't paying attention. Okay, get our troops home, please. I still can't believe how much land we made Austria spit out. That's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, seven territories that we essentially won from them. That's just amazing. That's great. I love it. What's with all these free constables we keep getting? Why do we get free constables? It's so weird. Not complaining, it's just odd. Oh, Lakota. Hello, Lakota. How about we colonize you? One of the last territories in the game to colonize. And we have a diplomat. Oh yes, they want peace, do they? No, you don't want white peace. Well, then fuck off. Well, we still have a lot of infamy, so one option would be to just pause the video here and I'll come back when the infamy is low enough to actually like do something cool with them, because we can't make them spit out anybody. So my only real option would be to take... Let's see, where the hell is their capital? Their capital's Gying. So I could take... What I'm thinking is, if I leave them with a coastal province, then they could be a useful vassal. Hold on. Alright, I'm back. I've got some food cooking. I'm ready to keep playing, though. But yeah, I believe if we uh, left them with their capital city of Giyang, and maybe one, two, three, four with these territories, if we could vassalize them with just those few, in other words, take everything else, then... Uh, 
they'd make a good vassal because they probably would be able to make a decent army and I'm sure they could make enough of a fleet to go invade someone, right? So, if we do go to war with them, I would like to take this and this and this and this and this and of course Sichuan Bana because I have to rename that to Banana again. But yes, yeah, so that'd be one, two, three, four, five, six. So 24 infamy. So I'd have to get my thing down really, really low. And I may not even be able to take it all at once. So that's what she said. Well, this one could go to Sean. They do have a core there. That might be interesting, actually. If we uh, spring up some Sean rebels. Although uh, they are the wrong culture type, so that probably wouldn't work out too well. But yeah, I think I'll pause here and we'll come back when we actually have uh, infamy low enough to do something about the Wu. But first let me check and make sure we have no other interesting causes bellies. Discovered spot Utrecht. Let's see what's up with Utrecht. Who the hell are you allied with? Oh, we have a truce. Oh, they're a vassal of Austria. Well then, we can't do shit about them, can we? Next time we go to war with Austria, the goal is not going to be to take their lands. It's going to be to spit out Sardinia, spit out Naples, uh, spit out Milan, spit out the Palatinate. Uh, uh, can't make them spit anyone else out except, I think, Sokoto or whatever. But the other goal is going to make them release their vassals, because they, they vassalized Ferrara, they vassalized Utrecht. Who else did they vassalize? Baden, Salzburg, oh, they have a lot of vassals, even Savoy. So if we could make them release some vassals, it would make them weaker in the next battle for sure. But yeah, I'm going to pause here and come back when we have something interesting. Oh goodness, Champa just insulted us and I was trying to figure out why, and I find they have a core here. So they're doing the same thing Mr. Popehead was doing a few years ago when the Pope got a core on my land right here. They're insulting us now in hopes that uh, they might be able to go to war with us. But since they're our vassal, all we have to do is give them some money and I'm sure they'll calm down. Or if they don't calm down, we'll just go to war with them and kick them in the teeth again. But yeah, that was just a quick little update there. So send a gift, we're back up to 200. We should be okay, I think. Ooh, cultural tradition, do I need it? Yeah, I'll take the cultural tradition. I've got a lot of magistrates anyway. Anyway, back to pausing the game. Well, 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 look at this. Well, first off, Bavaria's relations with us dropped down to one somehow, and I'm not sure why, but we're paying them to get that back up. But look at this. Violet's Fear of Influence against Portugal. How about that? Is there any more Portuguese land we could take? We took all of their South American land. They have nothing in North America. They do still have this up here, which is gold and copper. Gold and copper, but I'm I don't want to take that crap up there. It's so far away. <laughs> oh, they do have lands in Africa. Including ivory. They have lots of ivory. And gold. Ivory and gold. And more gold. And more gold. Holy shit, they have gold. Well. I might be willing to take these lands over here just because they have very profitable shit, but I won't. I won't take their lands, no sir. I won't take their stuff in Europe either. Oh well. It was a fun thought, but there's nothing of Portugal that I really should or even could take, so whatever. And back to pause. Oh my, look at this event. December of 1742. Since the invention of the printing press, more and more books, blah, 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 blah. Look at this. You get free investment in all these technologies. That's amazing. Oh, and the Pope annexed Urbino. Good for you. Baluchistan declared war on Persia. Blah, blah, blah. Wait, didn't I warn you? I should have warned you. God damn it. I thought for sure I'd warned Baluchistan. I wanted to vassalize those bastards. Oh, I haven't even warned Malwa. Why am I such an idiot sometimes? Well, in any case, they're warned now. Damn it. Is there any way I can join this stupid war? Please? Can I join war? Blah, blah, blah. 
Exploits. Arapaho. Don't care. It's gotta be in North America. Poor iron. Don't care. Alright, um, can I get an alliance with you? Nope. Hmm. How the hell can I get in on this war? And Baluchistan, you're an idiot for declaring war on Persia, by the way. Look how big they are. They are at war with the Ottomans, but they can't reach them, so they're not fighting. Albania... You're dumb, Baluchistan. And I'm dumb, because I thought for sure I had a, a, a warding on them, but... Ah, oh, well. I guess I'll pause and come back when I actually have an opportunity to do something. God, this is frustrating. Oh my goodness. So, the Papal State is at war with Achillea and Stria, who we just freed from Austria. So now we have an alliance causes possibility against the Papal State. <sighs> Man. It is really hard to pass up opportunities like this. I know that Russia can handle Lithuania, because... And Bohemia can certainly handle Lithuania. So I know I can beat the Papal State, but... If I ever did anything to them, it would be... I want to vassalize them. But I'm not sure I can. They are kind of large. But you know what? We're going to give it the old college try. So we're going to have to insult them a bit. And hope to God we don't get excommunicated. Yes, yes. Iowa, whatever. I will require this fleet as well. And you guys should move northward. Level 2, level 1. That's fine. Oh boy, this could be a very ugly battle. Who is the leader of the war? The Papal State is good. I'm glad it's not Lithuania. And who are they allied with? Lithuania and Castile. Ooh, well this could be very interesting, huh? Alright, let's get you over here. I'm gonna have to cancel... Oh god, I have access to Papal States as well. Jeez. Alright, 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 alright. We'll figure it out. Alright, get on the boat. Let me pay my troops. And pay my navy. And... Get on the boat. Thank you. Do you have leaders? No, you don't. You need leaders, sir. You have a leader. Kuduk, you don't need a leader. And Mosquito has a leader. Good. Then... You... No. You get this one. Cool. Alright, yes, yes, yes. Okay. Still can't. Okay. Well... Come on over. Do I have access in Gen Genoa? Yes, I do. Good. Genoa, Genoa, whatever. Go here. And you go... Oh, I don't have access here. Let me quickly get access here. Minus 110 or minus 110. None of them like me. They said yes. Okay, good. Then you guys can go here. And you guys, who just got on the boat, I guess you'll be going this way. Just don't take attrition, and we'll go invade down here. Oh, this is going to be fun. We don't have a truce with them, do we? No. Good. But we do have to insult them a little bit. Oh, what's this? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, pause please. Yes, yes, yes. Cancel access. Yes, definitely. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, good. Good, good. Oh, Genoa's at war with Mysore. Good for you. Oh, colonist. Colonist! So you're arriving in July. Then I'll just hold on to him. Actually, how many people is that? No, no, I'll go here. That makes sense. Okay. Good, you've arrived, so... You're all set. Napoli can handle 39 troops. Good, good, good. The Navy's healing up. Good, good, good. 
Ah, my big navy is all set. You're going to blockade Roma, because that's where their five transport navy is. And you guys, I guess, can go over here and see if they have a navy anywhere. They probably don't. You can handle 42 troops. Good, good, good. You're all set. Let's see what the fort levels are like here. Two, two, one, two, one. All right, so they won't be too difficult. Good. What about down here in Africa? One, 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 two. Perfect. Lovely. And you guys are almost in position. Hopefully by the time they're in position, I'll be ready to go. But I might have to get access to Portugal. Uh, we'll get access to Portugal. We'll just go dock up. Oh, I can't because it's occupied. God damn it. Then go here. All right. And they do not have any navies along here. Okay, that's interesting. But, oh, they do. They do have a navy. Okay, then I think we'll swap them. Because this navy is much more powerful. And it has a uh, admiral. Oh, look at that. What is that? Lithuania has a navy that's docked here. Cool. Stria's fighting them. So we might have to land some troops over here. We might even have to land some troops over here in Lithuania land. You know, modern day Ukraine. But we'll see. Alright. Let's get in position, everybody. And I need to insult them one more time. And then we can go to war. Uh oh, they're leaving. Well, I'm not sure I'll be able to follow them, because I don't know where they're going. But this navy is very large. Why don't we split them in half? Actually, no. I'll do it manually. We'll put 30 large ships. Where's my light ships? Bingo. Uh, 30 and 20, I think that might be enough. Well, I'll put a little more. Alright, 35. Let's get some more large ships. Thirty-five and thirty-five. That should be good. So we'll take those seventy ships with no leader, and we'll follow them, because I don't know where they're going. I'm kinda curious. Gulf of Toronto. Straight to Messina, okay. I'm just waiting until I can declare war, which will be 1st of August. So I have to wait a whole month. This could be a while of chasing. Alright, they're going to Bay of Napoli. That's over here. Alright, you guys are ready to invade, good. Now they're going to Straits of Messina. Wait! Oh, they haven't arrived yet, so we're faster than them. Cool. Oh, where'd they go? They went this way. Fuck, pause the damn game. Oh, no, I lost them. Oh, there they are. God damn it. Fucking pause the game. Pain in the ass. Piece of shit. Ah, I don't care if a giant guard collapse. I want to know where this Lithuanian fleet is. And they've disappeared. This is just the remnants. So I guess they went this way, but I'm not sure anymore. God damn it. Maybe I'll try to follow these clowns. Oh, is that all of them? Yes, they're going this way. Alright, so we're just going to stay here. Well, at least we can declare war now. Alright, good, we have alliance causes belly. So that should be all we need. Let's let them land here in Barbary Coast before we declare war. So Lithuania's main fleet is now here. Declare war. Alliance causes belly. We engage the enemy. That's nice. We're gonna invade Ferenzi and invade Abruzzi. And I believe that's gonna be it for the Papal State. You guys go here. Actually, it's probably faster to get on the damn boat. 
and you guys invade here, and you guys invade here. What is that, level 2? Level 1, good. Good, good, good. I like level 1s. Probably faster just to get on the boat. Lithuania dishonored it. Who cares? Let us invite all our vassals to war. And I believe that's all we really need. We don't need the other vassals because they're too far away to make a difference. Oh, there's the Papal State. They're going to dock up. Ha ha ha, good for you. Alright, we killed some ships. Yes, yes, our vassals joined us because they're awesome. Achillea got peace only by getting rid of treaties with us. So we lost our alliance with them. That sucks. But you guys are still at war. Stria, so we'll have to go save them if we can. I don't want them to get vassalized by Lithuania or some bullshit. Oh god, we're full of... Uh, oh, what's it called? Full of magistrates. Let us use them, please. Churches. Yes, I like churches. Alright, we landed in a frenzy. We can siege that. And... Yes, we're on the boat. Good. Let's go here. They're apparently going to... Oh, they're still docked up. Good. Let's go dick around with the Pope. Did I kill them here? Where did where did Lithuania's navy go? I must have killed them. I didn't even notice. Well, let's go harass their... Uh, lands up here. And I believe their navy is gone. Yeah, I don't see Lithuania's navy anywhere. So you can go harass them as well. Siege that, please. Yes, yes, yes. Siege it. Siege it. Siege it. Oh, it's a level 2. Hold on. Now siege it. Yes, yes, yes. Church this, church that. Alright, tomorrow is done. Go back home. 43% already. We haven't done it damn thing. So what does it cost to vassalize you? Or can we? Please tell me it's under 100%. Please tell me it's under 100%. Please tell me it's under 100%. It's not. It's 178. God damn it. But we can make him spit out Urbino and Tuscany. Tuscany... Oh my goodness. Look how big Tuscany would be. Wow. Wow. And they would accept. Well. And Urbino would be just that one. But... but whatever. So as far as war score goes... We would have to do a lot of damage to get 78% out of them so that we could vassalize them in the future. So maybe we'll just take this stuff, you think? I mean, these... I mean, it's probably fur, and this is probably... Let's take a look. What is this? Sugar, and fish, and fur. So it's not you know, incredibly useful. Ivory, ivory, ivory. I mean, I don't mind having these. I just don't really want to take Africa, you know? I'll leave that to the Europeans. I would like to vassalize them while they own this, though. So maybe the right thing to do would be to take... I mean, to uh, make them spit out Tuscany and then leave them with just Abruzzi and then we'll take these three. That thing, that thing, and this thing. You think? We'll see if we can get them... Above 78%. That's our goal, is above 78%. And we're blockading them. That's amazing. We should go save Stria. Well, we'll put that I thought on the back burner. We'll do it eventually. No rush. Oh, there's their navy.
Ah, yes. War in the Middle East. Don't care. Siege it. I just realized this navy of mine is only 20 transport ships. There's nothing else. But it looks like we're winning anyway. Oh, there's their main navy. And their main navy's dead. And their other navy's almost dead, but we're going to lose some transports. We lost one transport, but we killed the rest of their ships. So we're going to dock up and heal those up. And we now need one more transport. Do we have a fleet perchance with an extra transport that I could borrow? 20, 20, 20. No. Give me the navy. 23. Perfect. Alright, you are going all the way over here. All the way over here. And we're going to meet up right there. Lost a ship, but we have extra transports lying around. Just in case, you know? Yes, siege it. And siege this too. 77%. Brilliant. Oh, my vassals are over here. Cool. I don't have access. Uh, There we go. Burgundy declared war on Castile. Oh, ho, ho. And since we uh, guaranteed, not guaranteed, we warned Burgundy not to go to war, that means that we now have cause us belly on Burgundy. So let's see, we have until January 6th, so we're going to wait for the new year and hopefully finish up this war before we join that one. Grenada declared war on Castile. Awesome. Come on, Popey. I'm going to kill all your units. How do you like that? Maybe converted some more people in England. Okay. So now it's time to get our war machine going. Oh, Castile wants us to join... So we can't get war against Burgundy directly. We can only do it if we click on this shield. So we're going to lose one stability because we have a royal marriage, but I'm not too concerned about that. The other option is we go to war with Castile. I don't know. Our exhaustion's not bad. Hmm. Well, let's see if we get leadership. If we get leadership in the war, then that's fine. I'll just bring in all my allies against Burgundy, and it'll be like a fucking smorgasbord. Oh, wow, look. Two people are voting for Genoa. Two people are voting for Bohemia. Two people for uh, Burgundy. Nobody wants Bavaria anymore. That's funny. We should give Bavaria some more money. And let's see what this says anyway. We have warned Burgundy not to start war. Blah, blah, blah. Except, so we're now we're going to get the war against Burgundy. And, hopefully, we'll be leader. We are in control against Burgundy. Fuck yeah. That means call to arms. What? No. Very likely. There we go. Very likely. There we go. Who else? Who else wants to join our, our noble, worthy cause? Yes. Yes. Everybody must join our cause. Because we have leadership in the war. That makes us boss. We are the boss man. Oh, the Hurons. You're going to get in on this shit. Fuck yes. Kandesh, you want a piece of Burgundy? Hell yeah, you do. Malacca, you want to get your shit back here? Yeah, you do. That, that reminds me. I better get over there and do something about this. 
I have oh, 33,000 dudes. That means I need to get up here and pick up some of these armies. Jesus. 33,000 dudes. I'll take this one, and I'll take this one down. You should probably move over here. So you guys want a piece of it. Good. Call to arms. Good. Call to arms. Good. Call to arms. Good. Yes, everyone, please call to arms. Happy times. Everyone go to war with Burgundy. It is so satisfying having all these vassals. Really, it is. Just the fact that you can count on them to do your bidding whenever the hell you want. They never say, No, that sounds like suicide. They're always like, Point me where I need to go to die. And it's like, Yeah, yeah, you should go over here to die today. And they're like, Yes, we should go over there to die today. You are right. I'm damn straight I'm right. Why can't the Hansa declare war on Burgundy? Scotland, Ireland, Bremen, Bunch of Cologne, Magic, Oldberg. I don't know. I do not know. Anyway, they would be the best ally, but apparently they can't join right now. It's like, sorry, we're a little tied up right now, so tough shit. Alright, let's see who joins. Aha, Sweden joined. Yes, yes, all our vassals. Yes, Armagnac, Bohemia joined. Good, 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 good. Good, very good. Brunei, yes. Vassals, happy times. Awesome. Delicious. Awesome. Yes, awesome. Awesome. Fun times. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. You know what it is? Maybe maybe the Hansa can join my war against Burgundy, but maybe they can't join against the Papal State. Maybe that's the, what it is. That's probably the case. But it doesn't matter. Papal State's 95%, so we essentially can get whatever we want right now. So let's free Tuscany, and let's take... Oh, let's free Urbino, too. And let's take this and this. It's only 48. Hmm. Well, maybe we just stay satisfied with that, you know? I mean, it's not the end of the world. Yeah, I guess that's okay. Oh, they don't have much money, do they? Wow, look at all these cores they have. Get rid of your core on my lands, you little bastards. The fuck's wrong with you? Yeah, get rid of your... Why would you have a treaty with the Ottomans? You're the fucking Pope. You shouldn't have treaties with Muslims. Hmm. So that's really all we can do, unless we actually wanted to take some of this land from them. But really, I really, I think that's just too much... Too much hassle. And I don't want Africa anyway. So... Yeah, we'll, we'll finish up with the Pope like that. Alright. Tuscany's independent. Cult arms, of course. Royal marriage, of course. Where's the Pope's capital these days? I wonder if their capital's gonna be in Africa. Well, there's their national focus. Where's your capital, Popey? I do not know. Anyway, you can go back to Lenape. Don't need you there anymore. You're already set in Essequibo. Well, that's nice. We linked up our lands. And now we're at war with Burgundy. Oh, uh-huh. So I guess we can... Uh, oh, I know what we should do. We should link up our armies. Let's all meet up here. Actually, let's go meet up in Kumana. No, 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 no. Let's go meet up in Kumana. And, uh, yes, you armies should meet up in, shit, Cusco, I guess. They're so far away. You should go here. You guys should go here. We'll meet up all our armies, because we have 60,000 dudes here. And you guys can get back on the goddamn boat. And we haven't received our replacement boat yet. Where is our replacement boat? There you are. So you got a ways to go. Why are you taking attrition replacement boat? Don't be dumb. There. Yeah, you guys can just chill and bend in, I don't care. And I'll pick you up on that 20 boats. You guys need to get out of here somehow. We'll take the one that's almost healthy first. And the rest of you can go sit in Rome. Hey, 
Hey, Royal Marriage with Tuscany. Good. Now, oh, we don't have a diplomat. We've got to wait for a diplomat. Then we might be able to bring the Hans in because we're no longer at war with Papal State. See what I mean? You dig? Yes, yes, Stria has peace now. Good for you. <laughs> Makassar has warned us. Alright, you guys are getting on the boat. Oh, yes, yes, these, I forgot about them. You guys should come here immediately. And it looks like Burgundy's gonna invade me over here. Yes, they are. Good for you, Burgundy. You guys are the best. Uh, where's my navy? Oh, yes, they're over here. Good. So we're gonna bring this army over here, and this army as well. We just need the boats for it, so it'll be a little bit. But yeah, that was a successful war against the Pope. We took some infamy, which I didn't want to do, but it's the only way we're going to reduce their uh, cost to vassalize. So is this their new capital? It is. Their new capital still in Italy. But they might move it. They'll probably move it to Africa. Where's my damn boat? Oh, come on. Hurry up. We're all waiting on you. Alright, you guys are all set. Oh, it's only 10,000. We need more. Okay, yes, you guys are on the boat. Good, good, good. Let's see, 34,000. Armagnac, you guys joined the war, right? Yes, of course you joined the war. Alright, you guys are gonna go... Up here, I guess. We'll invade from the north. Because these are the lands that are most densely packed together. Stop taking attrition, bastards. Ah, oh, stop taking attrition. Oh my god. There. Not hard. Oh. Well, Burgundy seems to have some boats here. We might have to dock out. In fact, that might be a good idea. Where is my ship? Forgot Burgundy had all this shit down here. So, why don't you go dock up here in the Hansa's land? Let's see, will you guys join the war? No. Apparently you don't want to fight Burgundy for some dumb reason. Well. Hmm. You guys are moving, and my other boats are coming. Good. Alright, you're on the boat. We're happy. We're happy. Happy boat time. Happy boat time. You guys are going to come here and duck up. And you guys are going to go over here. And you guys are going to ditch your general. No, you don't need to. Papal State is on our side in this war. Look at that. Look at that. Where's, where's Mr. Pope? Mr. Popehead. Pope hat. Whatever. Papal State. There he is. We just fucking kicked his ass, but he's gonna give it the old college try. Oh, there's our nice navy. Look at that. 155 ships. Holy crap. Get out there. Holland. Oh. Well, I hope we kill their navy. Yeah, we're killing their navy. We lost nothing, they lost everything. But they did unload their troops, so... Bravo. Alright. Let's go this way, please. And we're gonna keep all our troops bunched up, because... Uh, I just feel like it. Yes, alright. So we have two armies here, and... We're ready to go. 40,000 versus 28,000. And we're going to go pick up some more. Because why the hell not? Yes, by all means, send another colonist there, please. Send one here, too. Oh, we're killing more ships. That's good. That's good. How's this little fight going? Still going, huh? Well, we haven't lost any ships yet, so why don't we dock up while we still can? Oh, phone call. Hold on. No, oh, we did lose two. That sucks. All right, pause in here. So apparently we we're going to require a couple more replacement ships, but that's okay, because I do have some more spare ships. I just need to separate them and make it happen. I'll just take the two cogs, because nobody likes cogs. Cog. There we go. And you crappy old ships can go this way. 
And I guess I'll have you dock up over here. Oh, why do you want to take attrition? Why must you always take attrition? Please just dock up here. And then we'll work on getting... There. Over here. And we will move our fleet over there eventually. But for now, you're just kind of stuck. Just go to Gold Coast. I'll pick you up with one of my other fleets. What I should do is strip off some of this gigantic fleet once they drop off their troops, and then we can send some of these ships down to join my transport fleet so that they'll actually be a little stronger than just 20 transport ships. Yes, yes, you docked up. Good for you. Oh, look, they're standing ground. Look at this. I need another general. There we go. Bhutan collapsed. Oh, but they didn't lose any land, so who cares? Alright. You are all set to invade Burgundy. Let's go. Level 2, level 1. Oh my, these lands are very soft and squishy up here. Do they have any level 4s? Not seeing any level 4s. Seeing some 3s. Wow, Burgundy is squishy. I approve. And 37,000 versus whatever they have. Alright, you guys are set to invade. Good. You guys are almost set to invade. Good, 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 good. And you're invading my vassal because that's all you can think of, you stupid AI. Oh. Whoops. <laughs> YouTube video just started playing randomly. Alright, you're on the boats. Very good. Let's go down here and uh, shock them a little more with even more troops. Okay, good. Our reinforcement troops are landing. Landed in Vlendaren, whatever, siege it. And you're running back to Beneculine, or whatever the fuck it's called. Siege it. Alright, yes, you. Take some ships. Shippies. Ships of Awesome. Alright, 23, that's enough. And some frigates, please. Frigate, 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 frigate. There we go. 23 and 20. Sounds good. Now you're gonna take your dumb ass and go join this fleet, which is fucking helpless. And we're all gonna meet up and have a party. Alright, you guys are all set. We're gonna go... Let's see, what do they have? One, 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 two, one, two. So they have no forts worth mentioning here. So maybe we'll just take you around the long way just for shits and giggles. No, shorter, shorter this way, apparently. And my cat is going nuts. What the fuck, girl? What is wrong with you, girl? You want to go in the trash again? She has this habit of falling in the trash can. Anyway. So we're going to send you guys over there, that's fine. You're invading. You're going to invade as well. But yeah, I think we're, we're in good shape here. We will eventually have to take all this stuff, but... One step at a time, my friends. One step at a time. Oh yes, you, by the way, need to go a little different route. Not going to dock up there. We're going to go pick up these, these guys. And then we'll go back and pick up the rest, yes. Hansa, you want to come? Nope. Hansa's not interested in playing our little game. Clay is finished. Blender and failed. You guys suck at sieging. You suck at life. Do the level one, yeah. Alright, now move on to... I guess start in Antwerp, why not? So they're starting to build an army up there to try to deal with this, but it's not going to work. Okay, you guys are all set. Go to Graupara. Oh wow, we're going to be way over on this video. 
Hmm. Oh, discovered spy against Burgundy. I should probably use a spy over here so I can see what the hell they're doing. Gagne is their capital. Give me infiltrate administration. Succeeded. So they have nothing. All their troops are down in my vassal's lands. Oh, no, they're leaving. Where are they going? They're going up. They're going north. Okay. So they are going to come deal with me, just not yet, apparently. Alright, we arrived first. That's good. They're going to arrive... soon. And Antwerp. Yes, yes, Antwerp. Good. Where did my Picardy army go? Oh, they both went to Antwerp. Really? Why would you both go to Antwerp? What the fuck is wrong with you to make you both go to Antwerp? I wanted you to go to Picardy. Oh, jeez. Whatever. That's so dumb. Can't believe you did that. And their navy is at Picardy, so I definitely need to go to Picardy. Alright, you guys are back in position. There's no Burgundian, Bur 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 Burgundian lands up there. Uh, I guess I could come down here. Spain and Castile are just kind of dicking around. Oh, you're going north. No, you're staying still. Okay. Hmm. Alright, looks like they lost a lot of dudes. They're running to Lampung. So what I will do is run to Lampung as well. 22nd of August. We're going to beat them by a whole month. So we're in good shape. And Bangalore is going to get back on the boat. And Indochina is going to go... Oh, I don't need to. Cool. Indochina, just go back to Johor. You guys are all set, good. You just chill, you're fine. I believe I can get rid of this and send them here. There you go, no, no, no. There you go. Hope you feel better. Wonder if Bohemia's gonna send anyone over. They're probably still reeling after that war with Austria. And Russia doesn't seem too excited to send anyone over either. I mean, what, what good is an ally who has access to water but doesn't do anything. Bohemia's got lots of ports now, but they don't send anyone over. Oh my, wait, maybe I spoke too soon. Looks like they brought over five troops. Oh, they got some more. Two transports. Oh, goodness me. Bohemia, you are really laying it on thick. Well, it looks like they're coming to relieve me up here, so I need to finish this siege rapidly force out their navy, kill their navy, and then I'll retreat back over to our homeland to heal up. Sound like a plan? Good. Alright, you guys are all set to go here. And build a fort, please. Oh man, we're full of magistrates. Uh, churches. Everybody loves churches. Oh my, we have a lot of money. And that's with paying our troops full price. Or 100%. Whatever you want to call it. Support. Alright, good. Bangalore, you guys can go home. You did a good job. And you guys failed to siege again because you suck. Or maybe I never pressed the button. That might be it. Yeah, you guys are trying to run, so why don't we mop you up? There's their navy. Oh, they're trying to run. They're not gonna run. Pirates, no! 
And we killed... Oh, so their navy's dead. You guys can get back on the damn boat. Yes, yes, here comes 34,000, but it doesn't matter because we're getting back on the boat. Now we're going to kill that little army and then get back on this boat. You get it? Alright, they're dead. Get on the boat. So the point of all this is simply to heal up. And then when they start sieging this stuff, uh, we can come back and land on top of their head with 40,000 guys. Hopefully fully healed, but we'll see. Hansa, Hansa still doesn't want to join us. Hansa, can't you be a team player, man? I mean, I've been supporting you all these years. You've been a great ally. And I would like you to help us now. We could use your help. But, yeah, this war looks like it's going to go on for several years. So I think what I should do is end the video here. Because we've been recording for a long time. And I will start another video for the uh, ending of this war. Or the completion of this war. Alright? So I'd like to thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you next time.